Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Christy and I have another Dollar Tree haul for you guys today. I usually do not do uh, consecutive days of videos, but I had an appointment today that got shortened and I thought I'll just go to the Dollar Tree. I wasn't expecting to find a ton of new items, but I did and I wanted to show you guys what all I found in case you were on the lookout. So remember, if you're not subscribed, I would love it if you went ahead and done so. If you like this kind of video, give me a thumbs up. I will have any videos mentioned uh, and my Instagram name down below in the description box if you want to check that out. And let's go ahead and get started. Okay, I want to start out today's haul with my favorite find and it was this iron decorative tabletop cross. This is not a Greenbrier brand. It says Walmart. I scanned the barcode to pull it up. It's out of stock, but I did get to read about it. It says vintage tabletop cross. Um, it says it is made of iron. It's really heavy and it says the color is rust. They had several of these in stock. It is extremely heavy, but I loved these. I wish I could find the price on walmart.com, but they didn't have it. These are gorgeous. Be on the lookout for these. Okay, another new product I found today is the stone key holder. It was up at the register in a little bag like this. It's just like a faux stone or a faux rock. On the bottom, it has the little container. You just pull that out and you can slide your key right in. And then you can hide this anywhere, like in your garden or one of your flower beds. I thought that was so cute. Okay, also up at the front of the store, they had a jewelry hanger. And it says, organize accessories. It's got a place right here for your earrings. It also says scarves and necklaces. So, got the ribbed edge right here so you can hang either your scarves your necklaces and this goes all the way across this is a, a Greenbrier product they only had it in the white but I thought Kerrigan would like this to hang some of her items on up in her closet I also picked up some of the bath bombs they had tons of those in today they were right up front I'll try to add a picture right here <laughs> sorry um, so you can see what the display looks like when I walked in. So I picked up, um, this one says, treat me bath burst. And it just says hashtag spa goals. And it looks like a little um, milkshake. I don't see any scents on these. These, these are a Greenbrier brand. And... They're individually wrapped on the inside too, so you can't smell them this time like you could before. This one is just a little cupcake. And they had the butterfly. Then they had the unicorn. And then they had just the regular ball, so like the bath bomb. And then they also had in the Spa Naturals bath bombs. I picked up, this one is the three pack. It says three pack fizzies. And this one is the cherry blossom. Normally I don't like the scent of cherry blossom, but these smell so good. So I picked up that one. I also picked up the vanilla and coconut and they had a lavender too, but I did not get that one. They smell wonderful. They are not a Greenbrier brand. It says distributed by Blue Cross Laboratories in Santa Clarita, California. And then it just says Spa Naturals um, Luxury Collection. So be on the lookout for all the bath bombs. They had more, I just didn't pick them all up because I still have a ton of bath bombs from before. I picked up some of the poo be gone that you guys have been seeing everybody haul. Um, we do have the poopery in our bathroom and uh, we love it. And I've been hearing great things about these. So I wanted to go ahead and pick them up. I picked up one of each. This one is the fresh citrus and you get 1.85 ounces. It says before you poo spray bowl, keep the stink in the bowl. And it says up to 300 spray, up to 300 sprays for 100 uses per bottle. And then this one is the lavender vanilla. 
So I picked up two of those. <sighs> okay, I picked up another one of the Sinful Colors Candy Johnson nail polishes. This one is called Mint Sugar, and it's from the Candy Johnson Sugar Collection, I guess because it has like a glitter color in it, so it's going to have a little bit of a sparkle to it. Let me just tell you, um, a couple of hauls ago, maybe it was last haul, I think it was, I uh, purchased the Sinful Colors uh, nail polish in the neon pink. If you remember, that neon pink was a gorgeous bottle, but when you open it up, the bottle is tinted. That is not the color inside. It's a really, it's a pink, it's a, it's a neon pink, but it's not a bright neon pink. It's like a see-through neon pink. So I was not impressed with that one. So I went ahead and picked up one of these. I guess I should have just known to stay away from the neon colors. I'm sure they're not for me. I did pick up one of the Crest HD Pro Health Try, uh, try Me Size Toothpaste. This one is two steps and each tube has 0 0.85 in it. And it says fluoride toothpaste with anti-cavity, anti-gingivitis, and sensitive teeth and whitening gel. So there's a lot going on in this little box. But these are the perfect size for travel and I like to pick them up. Um, they're also the perfect size just to throw in the kids' backpacks or any of the travel bags overnight bags. I did pick up two of the Sun Drenched Mango Candles. They did not have any of the coconut leaves in. And I love a tropical smell. They did have these. This is what I picked up. I've not burned one of the Sun Drenched Mangoes yet, but I'm hopeful that it's going to smell like it does in the container. You guys know how I feel about the old Williamsburg candles. They're some of my favorites. And uh, every time they come out with a new scent, I go ahead and pick that up. Okay, I've hauled the Chalk Blast Explosions in the past, but they had three new colors in at my stores. So I went ahead and picked them up for the kids. They had the yellow, the green, and the purple. I've already picked up the orange, the pink, and the blue. So I'm gonna assume that I have all colors now. I'm not sure what else they could possibly do. Uh, but these look like little grenades. And it says it has over 200 plus throws. And I think if the kids throw these um, on the carport outside or the blacktop that it's going to make horrible mess but they're really going to enjoy it so i went ahead and wanted to pick those up for them it says for outdoor use only can't imagine why okay i did pick up a couple of food items while i was there they had the juicy juice freezer pops and you get 10 pops in these you get the berry the kiwi strawberry the apple and the fruit punch i'm not sure we've not tried these before but my kids are loving these right now in the 80 degree weather so they're going through them pretty fast. You've seen me haul these before, even in an empties video. I'll put my empties video link right here if you'd like to go watch it for the reviews. But they love these. They go through these faster than I can buy them. They're the Sunny D Freezer Pops, and it has the pineapple mango, the orange, and the orange strawberry. They love them. I've not tasted them, so I can't give my opinion, but they're going through them pretty fast. <gasps> They had some more tasty cakes, and you guys know that I'm a sucker for every every time I see the tasty cakes. So I went ahead and picked this one up. This is the Family 12 pack, and this one is the buttercream iced cupcakes. And you get six packs, and there's two each. And the retail value on these are $4.49 for this box. Then they also had these this is the peanut butter flavored cupcakes looks like it's got peanut butter filling on it this is six packs and they're individually wrapped i picked up two of these and i'm going to go ahead and put them in the pantry and not even let the kids know i got them for now because chris is coming home next week loves chocolate peanut butter so i thought that he would like to get into some of these before the kids eat them all I was trying to see if there's a retail value. Yeah, the retail retail value on these, well, it says $3.99 and $2.99. So I'm not quite sure what the retail value is. We'll go with $3. But those are a good deal. I always pick up Tasty Cakes when I see them. And lucky for me, they always seem to have them. The Chex Mix is back in at my Dollar Trees, and they had every flavor. They had the, tradi the traditional, the bold, the honey nut. Oh, they didn't have the turtle. 
So I guess they don't have every flavor. But I went ahead and picked up the savory cheddar. Uh, this is Kerrigan's favorite. These are much more expensive if you bought them somewhere else. These are the 8.75 ounce. And then I couldn't help myself. I don't know why. I just picked up some Laffy Taffy. And this is the orange sherbet and lemonade raspberry flavored. Do not need this. But the um, flavors just screamed. I needed to get them. And then I just picked these up to throw in my purse. And these are some mints that I had not seen in the past. They had them in peppermint and I picked up the Icy Spearmint. It says Cool Mints, Icy Spearmint. They're sugar free. And I think the name is, is it Revo? R-I-V-O? And it doesn't, oh yeah, there's 33 little mints in each container. Okay guys, that is all I have for this Dollar Tree haul. Tons of new items and they were still stocking. Yeah, I only went to two Dollar Trees. Oh, I did stop by my favorite Dollar Tree and it was empty. And when I say empty, I mean the shelves were gone. They had took everything off the shelves. They were rearranging everything and I did go down one aisle, which was completely empty, but it said uh, snack zone. So they're putting in a snack zone at one of my stores. I am so excited because I see other um, Dollar Tree haulers showing those huge, long, absolutely amazing snack zones at Dollar Tree. And I'm always so jealous. So I'm so glad we're getting one of those in. Um, remember, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do so. I'd love to have you as part of my family. Please join me on Instagram. I'll leave the name below. Hang around and check out some more of my videos and I hope everyone has an amazing weekend and I will see you soon. Bye.